Hey Leo, welcome to your reading. This is going to be in the next 48 hours. So let's get into it. If this resonates, please like and subscribe. Hit that bell so that you don't miss any uploads. If it doesn't resonate, take a look at your other placements. They may be uh, resonating with you more at this moment. Okay, so the next 48 hours for Leo, what's going on? What can they expect? What's coming forward? What is coming through for Leo? Okay, we have Messenger of Action. Okay, so something new and exciting related to creativity in your career comes to your attention. You feel an eagerness to learn and you're ready to get going. Although you may feel insecure, do it anyway, Leo. This card represents someone in your life, or maybe you, who is creative, enthusiastic, and fascinated by life, who wants to try everything. Okay, beautiful energy for you, Leo. Uh, I feel like this is—I feel like this is your energy coming through. We also have inner strength. Leo, you're coming through very loud and clear here, okay? This is the strength card. You have a great courage and kindness. You may not realize how strong and powerful you are. But there's no problem you can't solve. The compassion you so freely give to others must also be given to yourself. Stand strong in your convictions if the right answer to tell someone is no, okay? So Spirit is letting you know not to be afraid to say no in certain situations. If you feel like you are pushing yourself too hard, you feel like you're doing too much at the moment, you know, you may have a lot of things that you're doing on your plate at the moment. So feel free to say no if you become overwhelmed, okay? Let's see what's going on with Leo love life Let's see what's going on with Leo and love okay we have separation so you may be separating with someone I feel like someone may be missing you or thinking about you someone really wants to speak to you and you know I feel like they have something very strong to say okay and yeah definitely there's someone chasing after you someone is watching you Leo I feel like, you know, someone has their eyes on you, like they're watching your moves and, you know, kind of spying on you. Um, this also may be a ex coming back who's kind of paying attention to the things that you're doing. Maybe they're watching who you're seeing, who you're going out with. But I feel like someone's keeping their eye on you. Someone's chasing after you. Okay, it may be due to the separation that you're going through. There's someone that you may be separated from who is still trying to keep tabs on you, Leo. Okay, um, and I feel like they are trying to really figure something out. You know, they're trying to see what your next moves are. You know, where you're going with things. Okay, let's get some messages. Let's get some messages from this person. If this person were to approach Leo, what would they say? What would they say to Leo? Spirit, give me a message. What would they say to Leo in the next 48 hours, please? I bear myself in work to forget about you. Yeah, I feel like someone is doing the most. I'm not available. This, this may be your energy or theirs coming out. I'm not available. This may be some kind of situation where they have somebody already, but they're kind of crushing on you really hard and they're like scoping you out, seeing what you're doing, you know? Interesting. Yeah. They want you. Someone really is taking time out to figure out what is going on with Leo. Let me put this over here. But someone wants you, Leo. Someone's really thinking about you. Look at this. Sometimes I'm, I stay awake thinking about you. Yeah. I feel like they're... 
they're just spending a lot of time. Maybe if you have social media, maybe they're spending a lot of time trying to contemplate how they're going to text you or come across. You know what I mean? Because I feel like that energy is just like chasing. They're like going after you. Okay? So, the, you know, this may be an ex. This may be someone who really wants to get back at you. So, um, be aware. Be aware, Leo. Okay? Watch out for that energy because I feel like that energy is is pretty strong how they're attempting to kind of figure you out you know i feel like they're trying to catch you in some kind of mess okay okay let's get some tarot let's see what's going on with leo let's get some tarot what's going on with leo the next 48 hours give me a message spirit yeah the death card Something is over. There's changes happening. Someone wants to communicate. Hmm. And the Nine of Cups. I feel like for you, on your side, Leo, I feel like this may be something that has ended that you may want back. Okay? If this is your energy, it, this could be... The other person's energy is still coming through here. But I feel like, you know, you were done with something. It was done and over with. But, you know, there's still communication trying to come through. There's still open communication here. So I feel like maybe you're still talking to this person. Maybe you are still have some sort of communication open with this person. Okay? But I feel like... In the back of your mind, this is something that you want to you want back. This is something that you really want to pursue that you're really not over with yet. Um, and you know we have the death card here, but I feel like this is more of a feeling of something changing. Um, maybe that's the reason why we have the uh, messenger of action which is the knight of wands and the strength card so i feel like you know your energy is like going for it and you have the strength to pursue whatever it is that you're doing because you know you're building up that courage you're building up that ego okay leo so i i feel like i feel like this is past energy but I feel like it's something that you really want back. You really want to bring this energy back. Very interesting. Tell me more about this. What is this death card? Tell me more about this death card, Spirit. The Queen of Pentacles and the Magician. Someone's not done. Someone's not done with you. I feel like you put a lot of time and energy into a situation trying to create things exactly the way you wanted it, Leo. And I feel like it just didn't come out the way that you expected. But I feel like, you know, this is energy that you want to try again. You want to keep working at this. You're, you're hoping for something to change in the situation so that there will be something that will be actually created into this. This may be, you know, a relationship that you really tried very hard to make work. Um, but I feel like with this Queen of Pentacles here, I, I feel like this is something that you work very hard on. This is something that you put a lot of time and energy into. And I feel like that energy just was not reciprocated. Okay. And I feel like you're still trying to create the kind of atmosphere that you're looking for. You know, you're still in that mode of maybe that's the reason why we have the open communication here. Someone is still able to communicate with you. I mean, you haven't blocked them or or anything like that. OK, so, you know, I, I feel like in the back of your mind, you're kind of hoping this person comes back or keeps trying. Look at this for the eight of wands. We have the strength card. And the Nine of Pentacles. Definitely. 
definitely. This is either your energy or this person over here that's coming through. But I feel like they're not going to give up. They're not going to give up. They're building up their courage. They're building up their strength to kind of step forward and communicate with you. They, they, I feel like they have a lot to get off of their chest. This is either your energy or theirs. You know, there's a lot that needs to be said that hasn't been said. And I feel like, you know, they're building up the courage or the... The strength to kind of say what they need to say. Bring that out, you know. For the Nine of Cups, we have the Page of Cups in reverse. Wow. So this person didn't give exactly what they attempted to offer. Okay. I feel like this person made a lot of promises that they didn't keep. Or they kind of let you down in a way that, you know, really had you really discouraged, really feeling bad about the situation, you know. Um, but I feel like there's some kind of offers that were spoken, but never done. Okay. But I feel like there's still an intention in the back of your conscious, you know, saying, you know, I want to try again with this situation. I want to see if it will be better this time. Okay. See, but we have the sun in reverse. Okay, Leo, I'm not sure if it'll be better, better this time. Look at this, the fool in reverse. Hmm. I feel like this new beginning, it's going to be the same thing over and over. It's not going to bring any, any happiness to you. It's actually going to be more draining than fulfilling for you. It's... It's a lot of energy of, you know, I'm not sure where this is going. And there's a lot of questions that are left unanswered. You know, I feel like it's not going anywhere. It's like a journey not ending, you know. Very interesting. But I feel like. I feel like either you or this person still has hope for the situation. You still have hope that you can grow and build this into something that's something that you're more capable of. I feel like you're both waiting. You're both waiting on something. You're both waiting on words that are left unsaid. You know? I feel like there may be lies. There may be a lot of untruths that were spoken. Yeah, it's leaving you not really knowing what kind of perspective to take. I feel like there's a lot of confusion. There's, there's no full understanding of the situation, Leo. Let's get a message. Let's see. These are handwritten cards, but let's get a message for Leo. Tell me more about this situation. Tell me more about this situation, Spirit. What can Leo expect the next 48 hours? What can Leo expect the next 48 hours, please? Okay. Well, we have you'll get the money that you need very soon. So there's some kind of increase coming in for you. But we also do have, I want to come home. So I feel like in this separation, I feel like someone wants to come back to the, to the home place. To, you know, the place that you built together. Maybe you were living together, okay? Healing to create the perfect time to reunite. So I feel like someone's trying to fix the situation. Someone wants some kind of resolution with you. I want to get close to you, but I'm dealing with other things, okay? So I feel like, you know, there, there's something going on on the side. Um, I feel like there's some situation, but um, I feel like this person kind of feels like you're kind of like the soulmate that they've been looking for. Um, we have pay attention to the red flags, okay? And we have, I need to tell you the truth. Yeah, just like I was feeling. I feel like 
someone's only telling you half truths. They're not being totally honest with you. Okay, so let's let's see. Spirit, tell me where this relationship is going. Tell me more about this situation, please. Tell me more about this situation. The next 24 hours. Excuse me, the next 48 hours. The Knight of Swords. Yes, yeah, someone wants to come in and speak the truth. They want to tell you how they feel. And we have the Seven of Pentacles. Someone wants to rebuild something that has been broken. Someone wants to see the situation grow. Yeah, the justice. I feel like this person that you're dealing with, I feel like they're now getting their karma. I, I feel like, you know, something that they've done in the past, maybe it's this, you know, not telling the full truth. I feel like things are coming back on them. I feel like they may have broken your heart in the past. They may have left a lot of things unsaid. They may have, you know, really promised some things that never really went anywhere. And I feel like they really want to come back and make things right. But they don't know how. I feel like they're feeling your pain now, Leo. I feel like they're, they're getting their karma for the way that they treated you. Things are coming back on them now, okay? And I feel like it, it's a little bit too hard for them to bear. They're like, okay, now, you know, now I know how you felt, Leo. Now I really, I need to tell you the truth. I need you to hear me, to, to listen to what I have to say. Because I feel like they, they have a lot to say. They have a lot to get off of their chest here, okay? Because I feel like they're trying to make amends. Okay, let's see. Let's get some angel cards. Give me a message for this, this person coming through. Spirit, give me a message for this person. Okay. Yeah, they're trying to wait for their opportunity. If, if this isn't about love, this is an opportunity that's coming forward for you. This is maybe dealing with that increase, okay? Because you do have some kind of increase coming through for you. You'll get the money that you need very soon. So I feel like there's some kind of increase coming in for you, okay? That may be something to do with work or promotion or something like that. But you have some, some increase coming through, okay? And there's no need to worry. And I feel like you have strength. We also have peaceful resolution, okay? And I'm really feeling that. I feel like this person wants to be reunited. They want you to accept their apology, okay? Um, let's get an angel card. Let's see what the angels have to say for Leo. Okay, we have faith, humanity, and benevolence. Stay calm, trust the good in yourself and others, and see the light in the world. So have faith in your situation, okay? We also have sacred vision. Choose to forgive in order to heal. See the light in all, and remember that love has no boundaries. You know? I feel like spirit is saying that it's up to you. The next move that you take... It's up to you, Leo, okay? Um, and you do have free will, so, you know, no matter what a tarot reader tells you, you have free will to change whatever aspect of it you choose to, right? Um, let's get an angel number for Leo. What angel number do we have for Leo? Okay, we have, see, this is that abundance I've seen. There's some kind of increase coming in for you, Leo. We have abundance. 888. Blessings are here. More are on the way. Let yourself feel the abundant flow of prosperity that is all around you. As you stand in your highest self, you attract all that you once were seeking. Giving is always the doorway to success. Okay? And your affirmation. 
The more good I do in the world, the more abundant my life grows. I radiate the energy of loving kindness. Okay, beautiful Leo. Well, you know, I hope this helps you. If this reading resonates, Leo, please like and subscribe. If it doesn't resonate with you, of course, take a look at your other placements. and They may be resonating with you more at the moment. And until your next reading, Leo, many blessings to you. Love and light.